Hi everyone, Trevor Swanky, CEO of WorldSkills Australia. It's my pleasure to bring you this edition of Skills News. I would like to welcome and acknowledge all of our key stakeholders and right across from right across the board. As you can see, I'm working remotely from my home here in Toowoomba in Queensland. So hello to all my Queensland friends. I'd like to spend a little bit of time and acknowledge the challenging situation that we're all going through with this COVID-19 and the real, uh, I guess, change process that all of us need to meet on a daily basis, both in our personal and professional lives. It has had an impact on everyone, not just in Australia, but across the world. Last night, I had the honour of representing Australia at a forum with WellSkills International with 56 other member countries. I listened to a presentation from every country talking about the challenges of their vet and skills sector and, and some of the challenges that their World Skills associations are meeting at this time as well. It was, it was, I guess, pleasing to see that everyone's in the same boat, but it was pleasing to see that there's a real camaraderie across the world where people want to share uh, their, their intellectual knowledge, um, they, they're asking for assistance and help, and they really want to work in a collaborative way to, to I guess, at the end of the day, to make a difference uh, in our lives of our young people out there. I'm really pleased to announce that our national championships are not being cancelled, but they're being postponed. As you would realise by now that we, we were going to run the event in August this year in Perth with the great support and of our host state, the Western Australian Government, but we've postponed that to a time that we know that we can do it and do it well. We look forward to that event. It's going to be an absolute showcase of skills from across Australia. We hope at that stage to be able to invite some international guests to participate as well. We all know that it's about 10 to 12 months away. It's a long time. Our, our competitors were ready to go for this year. So what we've done is we're going to work hard with our competitors and our volunteers to ensure that they're in the best shape that they can be by the time the national championships come around. We've implemented a World Skills National Skills Training Program which will actually take all four to 500 young competitors that are going to compete next year and put them all on a training program. We're going to grow and enhance the skills of every one of our national competitors. We're going to give them the opportunity to do the best that they can when they come around to compete. It's going to take some effort. We've got some fantastic volunteers, our chief judges, our judges, our corporate sponsors, our partners, the trainers, all of our, young, all of our competitors out there. Everyone needs to come together to make this work. The support we've seen from people so far has been fantastic and I thank you and congratulate for you for coming on board. You would have noticed our slogan last year when we said we're on the way to WA. Now we're saying we're training the way to WA. Our first webinar will be exactly that, putting together and working with you on a training plan that will get you to WA to the national championships with a much improved skill set than what you have today. Our intent at that stage is to make sure that we choose an Australian team at the closing ceremony that will then hopefully be able to represent Australia at an international competition which is still planned for Shanghai in China in September next year. It's certainly our intent to make sure that Australia is well represented at that event. In closing, I'd like to thank you for your support um, for WellSkills Australia. WellSkills Australia is a partner in the skills agenda. We don't lead the skills agenda, we work with you from an industry perspective and a training perspective. We have a lot of partners across Australia. What we wanna do is to make sure that we get the opportunity to benchmark skills, both regionally, nationally, and also on a global stage. We wanna know that what we're doing here in Australia is in line with what's happening in other countries around the world. World Skills International is a fantastic organisation. It gives us now the opportunity to work with 83 member nations across the world. Once again, I thank you for your contribution to World Skills Australia. I thank you for your contribution to the skills agenda, and I look forward to catching up with you all again soon. Please stay safe and well, and have a great day.